What's going on everybody? Today we're talking about the Group 24 size Lee Time 100 amp hour lithium iron phosphate battery. This is one of the newest additions to the Lee Time lineup and it's loaded with a bunch of new features, especially for this price point that it sits at. So like I mentioned, this is a 100 amp hour battery and that's 1280 watt hours at 12.8 volts. So you can hook up any of your 12 volt accessories to this battery. You can put it in series if you need to run 24 volts for like a trolling motor or 36 volts even if you need to run three batteries on your particular boat for a higher power trolling motor. On the surface, this is a typical smart battery. The battery management system has all those traditional features, uh, over voltage, low voltage, uh, short circuit protection, over current protection, all those basic functions, but it also includes two new things that I think for this particular size battery helps set it apart from some of the other batteries. So it does have low temperature charge protection, what that does is if the battery's frozen, you live somewhere where it's really cold and you still need to charge your battery, you plug in your charger. If the battery's frozen, it will protect itself and say, nope, I'm not gonna take a charge. And that's to prevent lithium plating, which will ultimately affect the overall capacity of your battery. And once the battery warms up enough, it will go ahead and accept that charge. So that's a protection feature to help you uh, from, keep from damaging your battery accidentally. One other thing that this battery has is Bluetooth connectivity. So you can take your Android phone or your Apple phone and hook up to this battery. You can see the state of charge, voltage, uh, battery cell, voltage individually, current draw. You get all kinds of different information out of that just by basically walking by it with your phone. And it's nice, especially in those multi-battery setups. If you've got two or three batteries, you're running 36 volts, you wanna make sure they're all charged, they're all kind of getting pulled, pulled on evenly. It's super nice to have that Bluetooth connectivity, especially at this price point and in the size battery. So like I mentioned, this is a group 24 size battery. So it's about two inches or so shorter than the common group 31 size battery. So especially in the back of a lot of these boats or in your RV or whatever you may have, that extra two inches here and there can certainly help give you some more storage space. You can put something in there, you know, put some tools or something in the back of your boat. And so the group 24 size gives you a little bit of benefit there. This battery is also only 24 pounds. So it's super light, especially compared to like a lead acid battery, it's about 50 pounds. Uh, a 50 pound lead acid battery is only good for about 50 amp hours. So you're half the weight and two times the energy density out of these lithium iron phosphate batteries, which is awesome. Something else worth noting is the cycle life on these batteries. This one's rated for 4,000 cycles, discharge and charge at 100% depth of discharge. So if you're fully depleting the battery and fully charging it 4,000 times, and that number even goes higher if you only bring it to say 50%, 60%, whatever depth of discharge, even at 100% depth of discharge, you're still getting a 4,000 cycle life out of these batteries, which is fantastic. Whereas like a lead acid battery is 250, maybe 500 cycles. If you really took care of it, kept it in a climate controlled garage and stuff like that. So you're way above the cycle life of like a lead acid or even an AGM battery. I did do a capacity test on it. So I pulled a, I fully charged it, fully discharged it at a 10 amp load and pulled 101 amp hours out of it. So it says 100 amps on it. You're gonna get 100 amps out of it. And that's really nice. You can be able to count on that when you're doing your calculations for how big of a battery you need. You can count on that 100 amp hours to be there for you. The other thing is how fast does it charge? So this will take a 1C charge rate. So if you happen to find a 100 amp charger, you can fully charge this battery in one hour. More likely is you'll find something in the 20 amp range, a 0.2C or 10 to 15 amps. And so the math there is pretty simple. If you have a 100 amp hour battery and a 10 amp charger, it would take you 10 hours to fully charge that battery. So kind of give that an idea of how much you plan on using it, how much time you have when you need to go back out again, and what size charger you have. It's pretty straightforward math there. As far as discharge rate, this is rated. This has the upgraded, uh, the same BMS that's in the trolling motor battery. So it's upgraded for those high constant loads. It will take a continuous discharge rate of 100 amp hours. So any of the trolling motors that you find, are gonna be able to be supported by a battery like this. You're, you're gonna be within range there. A lot of the 36 volts, even 24 volts, an Ultrex or something will be in the 50 amp, hour, 50 amp range. So you're good there when it comes to the continuous discharge rate. And that's gonna be a quick look at the Lee Time Group 24 battery. If you'd like to see how this stacks up against, I don't know, some 20 different batteries within this price point, check out this video right here. Links are in the description. We'll see you next time.